Okay. Judge number? Number four. Um, good evening. Good evening, Paul. So, ito yung question. Uh, since, uh, malapit na election day, so, um, if you were given a chance na, na, if ever lang, na ikaw yung uh, magiging first lady ng Pilipinas, ano yung gagawin mo sa bansang Pilipinas? Let's wait for the other changes. Yan ka ba na po? lang. Okay, first and foremost, thank you, panel board of judges, for picking me as one of the five semi-finalists, considering with these beautiful young girls. Back to me. Ito sa likod na lang, mahirap pa mag English. Okay, thank you so much for that timely and relevant question. May 2022, we are going to practice one of our rights, our right to vote and our right to suffrage. That was the only day that we are the superior person in this entire Philippines. And I believe that, ladies and gentlemen, it is a very important role of a first lady for me. Because why? I will serve as a guidance to my partner in order for her to govern our country in a better and a nice way. Ladies and gentlemen, malaki po ang parte ng pagiging isang first lady. Sabi ng mga tao, first lady lang yan, haharap, pag merong meeting, haharap, pag ipinapatawag. But always remember, ladies and gentlemen, a woman is the light of each and every single house. So therefore, if there is a woman beside his husband who serves as the President of the Republic of the Philippines, he will be guided what is right and what is wrong, what is correct on his decision to make. Ladies and gentlemen, always remember mga kaibigan, na ang First Lady po ang magsisilbing tagagabay ng ating presidente. Marami po ang nagsasabi nitong mga nakaraang politika na ang first na ang first lady naman daw po ay walang ginagawa. Nakaupo lang. Nandiyan lang kasama ang ating presidente. Ngunit lagi po nating iisipin na ang bansang Pilipinas ay parang isang tahanan. Kung may tatay na namumuno dito at may kaakibat na suporta ng kanyang asawa, mapapamunuan nila ang kanilang The Latin word, hagaas loke, hagaas porsoy. Siyempre, espejo reflecta iyo manyana. Or as a first lady, whatever you do for today should always be the mirror and reflection of your tomorrow. Always remember, ladies and gentlemen, if you are a better wife and if you are a better first lady, it can mirror up and re-echo to your president and to your husband. Lagi po nating pakakatandaan, do not underestimate the power of women. Because I always believe the woman and man, if they will going to unite each other, we can have a progressive country. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.